I've been in architecture for over eight years and by far the best CAD software I've ever used is AutoCAD. But for the past few weeks, there's been a completely new software that I've been obsessing over. I've been using it ever since. And the craziest part is almost no one has heard of it, including you, which is why in this video, I'm going to compare AutoCAD with Rayon Design so we can find out which software is the best. Starting with how easy they are to use and progressing through six more important categories like modeling, design capabilities, organization, collaboration, unique features, and cost. If you were trying to learn a new software, you would first want to know how easy it is to use without having to watch a million YouTube tutorials. So that's why we're going to start discussing the ease of use for AutoCAD and Rayon Design, starting with AutoCAD. AutoCAD allows you to work in an infinite canvas. And as you can see here, I'm trying to see how far it'll let me go. Right now, I've made a line that's over a million feet long. So I'm pretty sure this canvas is infinite. You have all the tools that you need in AutoCAD in the ribbon at the top part of the screen. But to access those tools a lot quicker without having to click through tabs, you can use the command bar at the bottom and type in whatever command that you want. You can produce precise drawings with the precision and snap features within AutoCAD. So as you can see here, when I'm drawing a line, you can start to align it with different edges and corners. And then you can change the settings of the snapping tool on the bottom right to snap to midpoints, snap to the nearest point, to endpoints, etc. AutoCAD is available in the desktop version, which I'm using here, as well as there's an AutoCAD Lite, which is limited in its features. There's also a simple web version that you can use for AutoCAD. Now for Rayon Design, it also has a huge canvas as well, and I really haven't found a limit for that either. Ryan has a minimalistic set of tools that keeps things simple and focused on that lower ribbon. But just like AutoCAD, you can also type in the commands that you want with the command bar in Rayon. There's also a few tabs on the left and the right hand side of the screen for additional features. But you can work online without having to download any complex softwares with Ryan Design. But if you want to work offline, you can also use the desktop app as well, which can be downloaded only in a few clicks. So is AutoCAD or Rayon Design easier to use? Well, Rayon Design features a clean, straightforward interface that's easy to learn with a minimal set of tools that keeps things simple and focused. Perfect for users who don't need a cluttered or overly complex design environment. AutoCAD is also very easy to use for simple tasks like 2D drafting, but it also offers a wide range of advanced features such as 3D modeling, automation tools, and industry specific tool sets for when your projects require more than just a simple drawing. While both Rayon Design and AutoCAD offer user-friendly experiences, their approaches to modeling reveal some key differences worth exploring. Category number two is modeling. With AutoCAD, you can quickly draw out plans like I'm doing here. But to add more detail, you can use blocks, which you can either import or create yourself within AutoCAD. But you can also model 3D geometries as well as apply materials within AutoCAD. Now this is a little bit more advanced, but still a great tool nonetheless. With Rayon Design, you don't just have to draw lines, you can actually draw walls as a component and then place windows and doors that fit right in. But you can also add blocks instead of manually drawing elements, just like CAD. But the main difference between the software is Rayon has a huge searchable library of blocks within the software. In addition, you can also create zones within the drawing to distinguish rooms and then further add detail elements. But you can also create tables to categorize all the furniture that you have, but also create a table of area calculations from all the zones within the design that you've created. And then you can add dimensions. You can add single dimensions or you can create dimension strings to dimension a whole length of a building. Which software is the best for modeling? Well, AutoCAD is great for creating detailed plans and 3D models, while Rayon Design brings drawings to life using their modeling features that allow effortless design. But the stakes remain high as AutoCAD and Rayon Design are trying to separate themselves with unique modeling features. The best software will become clearer in this next category. Number three, design capabilities. With AutoCAD, you have the ability to create 2D models and 3D models. You can also incorporate hatches and fill patterns to walls as well as floor plans. It's very simple to use, but if you wanna create a custom hatch, that can be a little bit more difficult to create that and then import it. But this is a great way to distinguish different elements by adding different hatches for different sections. Perfect for finished floor plans and things of that nature, as well as site plans. 
With Rayon Design, you can create drawings like plans, sections, elevations, and site plans. But you can also add hatches, textures, and color fills to the walls and the zones. But what's great about these features is it allows you to customize your plans without having to take your drawings into Photoshop to make them pretty. But you can also import pictures, allowing you to collage, add inspiration, and create furniture mood boards and so much more. And you can do this all in one place, not having to go to another software. So you can have drawings on one sheet and then mood board inspiration on another sheet, all in the canvas. After the first two categories, AutoCAD seemed to have an edge, but Rayon Design's unique design capabilities have set itself apart in its third category. So far, you've learned how easy both softwares are to use, their differences in modeling and design capabilities. But we aren't even halfway done with this comparison but things are getting competitive. Number four, project organization. With AutoCAD, you can use layer management that gives you the ability not only to hide layers, but freeze them, removing them from memory to improve the performance. And this also helps with having different elements within the drawing on different layers. You can hide them and organize them when you're sharing it with other people. But you can also create multiple layouts at the bottom tab where you can have different pages with different sets of drawings. You can also create sheets and templates for the drawings to go on and then publish multi-sheet drawing sets within AutoCAD, which is great for a set of construction drawings. But if you're working with consultants, you can link external drawings to keep large projects manageable and running smoothly. Now with Rayon Design, you can create canvases, pages, and views to organize content. Canvases are a space in which you can model and things can be drawn. Pages help you turn drawings into proper document sets that can be exported as PDF or images. And views are the best way that you can create references to an existing drawing, things like enlarged plans and enlarged details. But Rayon Design also allows you to import DWGs and PDFs, and then later export your drawings as DWGs, DXFs, PDFs, images, or straight to your printer. Now that you've learned how to organize your project in both software, let's see how AutoCAD and Rayon Design work for team collaboration. Number five, collaboration. AutoCAD has shared views which easily shares drawing views online without having to share the full DWG file, allowing people to comment and review on those shared views. AutoCAD also has real-time collaboration using the AutoCAD web app. Teams can view and edit drawings simultaneously from anywhere using the web or the mobile app. And then finally, another great collaboration tool for AutoCAD is it has version history and allows you to compare drawings. You can track changes and compare versions to ensure there's clarity between the drawings and also avoid conflict during collaboration. Now with Rayon Design, you can create public and private workspaces to control the access to your content for your teams. So you can assign roles to team members if you want them to see certain documents but not other things. You can allow them to edit or only view certain pages. With Rayon Design, you don't have to send an email of a DWG to all your team members. You just have to copy the link and send that instead. Members within the team can work real time on the project together, allowing for red lines and comments to be made by multiple team members all at once. Working on a group project or with a team can be incredibly inefficient sometimes, depending on which software you can use. But Rayon Design's collaboration features that allow for all team members to work real time make it easier to meet project deadlines. We're almost done, but now you know the basics of all the software and how it can potentially fit your needs. But the video wouldn't be complete until I shared some additional features for AutoCAD and Rayon Design, as well as the biggest determining factor for most people, which is cost. Now for the additional features. With AutoCAD, you can automate repetitive tasks and create commands using scripting and programming interfaces like Auto LISP. Now, this is a little bit above my pay grade, but I know you probably can't find this with many other software other than maybe Rhino, which I've heard of. You can also use dynamic blocks that allow you to adjust the shape, the size, or the configuration without having to create separate blocks. This can be useful for things like doors and windows. With AutoCAD, you can also integrate Google Maps which is great for site plan drawings. And finally, AutoCAD offers tool sets for specific industries like architecture, mechanical, electrical, plumbing, and they all have tailored features and workflows specific to each industry. With Rayon Design, you have a huge library of templates that you can start from, ranging from a studio apartment all the way to an office template. And I shared with you how to organize your pages and your sheets within Rayon earlier, but you can take it to the next level with Rayon Design's presentation mode, which allows Allows you to take all the sheets that you created in your canvas and present them slide by slide so you can start with your mood board and then progress through the drawing set.
we have finally reached the last category, cost. AutoCAD offers a 15 day free trial for the main version and for AutoCAD Lite, which we'll talk about a little bit later. AutoCAD is $2,000 annually, and then AutoCAD Lite is $500 annually. Now AutoCAD Lite is a little bit more of a limited version than AutoCAD. You can't do the same things and I'll list the differences on the screen right here. Rayon design is actually free to everyone and you don't have to pay unless you wanna upgrade, have access to more features like what is offered in the pro version, which is only $21 a month. But let's say you want access to all the features the team version would be the best for you, which is only $38 a month. So which software is better? Well, it may depend on what your needs are. But to me, Rayon Design is more tailored to interior designers and architects, whereas AutoCAD is favoring the engineers. But luckily for you, you can still import those engineered DWGs into Rayon Design and edit and style them as you need. But if you wanna give each of these softwares a try for yourself, I'll leave the links down in the description free to download. But let me know in the comments below which one you guys think is the best.